So there was a question about the call to action in the cumulative reading. So in terms of the collaborative reading, a lot of times I give you resources and links and things. I don't necessarily need you to read it all, you know, I give you a web page. Skim over it. See what's in there that is really important. If I really want you to read it, read it, I will uh, designate that. For the most part, I'm just giving you some resources and things to take a look at. So you have them, um, like how might you use these things or resource them later that you might want to bookmark them or add them to your Digo account. Um, but I don't necessarily want you to spend hours and hours reading, reading, reading all the different elements uh, that are in there. So I will direct you to that more specifically. I'll try to be better about it. In terms of the call to action, yeah, there's supposed to be where our discussion threads on Google+, Plus. although some of them are just asking you to ponder or do something else with it. Um, I tell you to post to Google+, Plus if, if I want it to be on Google+. Plus. But also try and find where other people have posted the same kind of response to the call to action so we can get a discussion going in there. Um, maybe that doesn't work and I'll have to try something else. I just really dislike the discussion boards in Moodle just because they feel so formal and I want you to have more uh, casual conversations um, and I find that Google Plus is a little bit better for that but that doesn't mean it's necessarily working. So let me know what you think. I can always move it back to just a regular discussion board in Moodle.